Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. It's that boy G playing. Don't give a damn. He cooler than the fan. Walking real tall. Some say he's man. Now, I'm not gonna lie. Now, I don't want to be the too vulnerable or have a soft moment, but have you got to that point where you was like on my lowest and like, I ain't saying you just cried, but you don't know how you came out of it, but you came out of it. It can be God, it can be the powers may be, whatever. Have you had that moment yet? Yeah, I just had that moment with my recent incarceration. Mm. Like, like me honestly, I don't know what they had going with the charges. They just, I just knew they wanted me so bad. Yeah, everybody ended up with a second degree murder and a tip to second degree murder. I don't know why they lay out. So I just, you yeah, heard, I just put this sh with the higher power. But left that sh with the higher power. Yeah. And you came out of that. Yeah, for sure. Now look, that's why you gotta take advantage of these these second chances. Yeah, and for sure. That's why you out. And I'll be trying for to. For sure, because I, I done had a few, you heard, man. Near death experience, you know, I got shot two different, two on um, separate occasions. Oh, I didn't know that. Yeah, I, I got shot when I was like 14, 15. And then I dug back, got shot when I was like 17. Hold on, you were 14, 15. Like, you was like in the Navy, I was outside. Man, yeah, it's crazy. <laughs> you got hit in the leg. I got hit in both my arms. Woo. Man. I'm pretty sure that was a traumatic experience. At that time, but you, I mean, you here now, you made it, you went through it. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? You know how it go. So, and hopefully, well, I ain't gonna say hopefully, they people will. They hear your story, and you can give them some insight of what really be going on. Yeah. I mean, so, like, I guess, man, but other than that, it's summertime. Uh, you gonna be traveling more, no more music coming, more. For sure. What's going on? Talk to us. For sure. I got a new, I got a new tape coming. I'm working on a new project. For sure, like I got a video shoot to my intro, my intro call before I wrote a verse. After after we finish up here, I got I got a uh, intro that be called before I wrote a verse. Yeah, be, yeah. I'm I'm coming straight hot. Then on side of that, I got a little EP for the ladies. It called Gangsta Turn Lover Boy, a little six song EP. What? I was just with for the ladies. Oh, okay, okay. That's what's up, man. I'm glad you highlight that, cause man, catering to women. It's very important. Keep it real, like, females more real than niggas these days. Like, Talk to her. like, you go on your joke, you know, you got your partners that'll do what they do, but it'll be your bitch that, you heard me, really, you heard me, come through and how to make sure everything go how it go. Like, the boy, the boy, they go, you know, they the boy come through, but you heard me, your, your girl, that's who really gonna be, you heard me, every step of the way, for, if you got a solid one. You're like, what gotta say? Uh, a real is always better than the bad. That's what he said, huh? That's what he said, nigga. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. for sure. So while you was while you was down, while you was joking, you had you had your your one that held you. For down. sure, for sure. Yeah. yeah, for sure. That's what's up. That's what's up. And like, like I was saying though, um, catering to <coughs> is is very important. They go buy your merch. They go buy your music. Anything go wrong, they go be there. Yeah. You know, and I'll be honest, I don't know what your analytics look like, but once you do cater, start catering to them women, hey, man, stick with that, bro. Because that, that right there, that's going to keep you book. That's going to keep them streams coming. That's yeah. going to keep them BMI chicks or ass cap, whoever you may with. They going to make sure you're going, you feel me? So, For man, sure. I get it. I get it. Now, when I walked in, I seen you with Lit Man. Yeah. I, I'm pretty sure y'all got a great relationship. Yeah, this 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 my best friend. Y'all been Joseph. Like tell what like what's your what's your relationship like with SOD? This this real like like my best friend. Like yeah. yeah, it ain't we ain't been through together. Like like you heard me. what what's mine is his, what his is mine. Like I call his mama mama, like you heard me. Like if I ain't chilling if I don't chill with him, like we we so we been locked in so long. I'll go post up and chill with his dad and we'll we'll sit up and run it. Like real talk. I go to his mama I go to his mama house. He ain't gotta be nowhere in sight. He could be in New Mexico. I'll go I'll go post up at this Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I see it. I, mean, I ain't trying to I ain't trying to count the pocket. But we got we got a little
got some change right here. So he, he walk in, yeah, you know. I'm like, oh yeah, they real, real tight. Yeah. I don't get me wrong. When somebody, I mean, y'all could be cool, but you pick up somebody's money, you can be like, hey man, I get it, we cool, don't play like that. But I can tell y'all, you know what I'm saying?